once I had enough charge, I had to go back up to the mountain by where I was fishing, stick the battery in there, and turn out the battery was bad. Then I had to go buy a battery up at the lake, put it in the truck, drive the truck down from the mountain while my battery light was flashing because the alternator went bad, got to the bottom, had to go buy a new alternator, put the new alternator, put the new battery in there, put a new um, serpentine belt in the truck just to find out that every time I step on the gas, my charge, like check your charging system light still turns on. So, plan is, I wake up today, I go for this run, come back home, I have to shower, get ready for work. I go to work at 8, 8 a.m. That's in a couple hours. Get off of work and then start working on the truck, which there has to be a short somewhere. I have to find the short. If I find the short in the truck, I gotta fix it. Put the truck back together because I gotta go back to, you know, I need a car, so that's just where I'm at. So it's you. You guys will see. <sighs> On top of that, I gotta you know clean up the house, put clothes to wash, dry, put it away. It's just a lot. But for now, we gotta focus on the run. So, wish me luck on this mile, and hopefully I make it under, uh, under 11 would be fine. Last time, my time was 9.59. Eh, big guy. And I haven't run a mile in who knows how long. So I thought anything under 10 was pretty good. But, since I didn't run yesterday, we'll see how that goes. Out here grinding. I'm hella tired, but I'm not quitting yet. All right, half a mile more to go. All right, so back from that run, I was able to execute that mile in about nine minutes and 53 seconds, which is amazing. That's the fastest I've done this probably this whole year. Uh, 2020 has been a crazy ass year. Lost a lot of great ones. Black Mamba, lost uh, Black Panther. The Black Lives Movement happened. Um, the elections this year, it was a crazy year. We also started a podcast. I'm gonna link that at the bottom of this video. You can follow the podcast. I have not done a podcast in the last couple of weeks, but I'm hoping to get back into it. It's just been a been so busy also have children so if you guys have children you know how it is I'm trying to work out and keep up but you gotta do what you gotta do it's 2020 so we'll see i'm gonna keep working out workout <sighs> stay hydrated <sighs> if any of you guys are like professional workout people or whatever 
Yeah, my phones are off or whatever. Look, I am drenched in sweat right now, okay? So, I don't care if I did it right or wrong. Hopefully I don't get injured, because I know that's what you guys are gonna comment. Like, well, you can get injured if you don't do it right, blah, blah. I get it. I've done sports for most of my life. Uh, I have to get back into it. I'm back into shape. So, as long as I get a workout and I'm sweating like I am right now, like a pig. Actually, pigs don't sweat. Um, I'm just sweating and it feels great. And I did my run, I did my mile under 10. I got my workout in, my, my 25 before going to work. I still gotta go shower, make some sort of healthy breakfast. I don't even know what I might have for breakfast yet. I might have, I don't know, maybe egg whites, uh, maybe an oatmeal. Point is, we just try to be healthier here. And try to eat healthier. I'm gonna try to minimize to almost none alcohol. Um, just trying to lose some at least 20 pounds by the end of this year. That'd be a blessing. I'm like six two, six three for people that don't know me, and I'm over 250 pounds. That's pretty heavy. So. Healthy me should be at 215, 210, maybe 225 with uh, body muscle weight. So if I could lose 20 to 30 pounds by the end of the year, I'll do what I'm doing. Or even if I gain a little bit of weight, but it's on muscle weight and get my waist smaller, I'd be okay with that. So I'll show you guys what I made for breakfast in a little bit. I gotta go inside, take a shower. And um, I'll go ahead inside, take a shower, make some breakfast, eat breakfast, get ready for work, and go to work. So, maybe I'll just drop this. That's my first vlog. And then uh, later after work, when I start working on the truck or whatever, maybe I'll drop, uh, you know, I'll drop another vlog on the same day. That'd be crazy. Two vlogs, my first day of vlogging. So, whatever, stay tuned. Let me show you guys what I'm gonna make. I'm out of the shower. I go to work in about 25 minutes. So I decided I'm gonna eat some oatmeal. So I'm about to make some oatmeal, eat and get ready for work and skedaddle. And I think this is it for my very first vlog. Woo! Hope you guys like it, enjoy. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, comment down below. Let me know, um, you know, positive feedback, negative feedback, I don't care. Um, at the end of the day, I'm only doing this just to have the memories, just to say I did it. If it goes somewhere, cool. If it doesn't, at least I tried it. So, 